trying to clear this one out. Blocked by Wesley on the backboard. A shot opportunity from Soggy. It rolls in. Not sure what happened there. But Soggy able to get the goal. 1-0 lead for Milwaukee Panthers early on. I think there was a bumping play coming out from Wesley. It's looking incredible. I don't think we've seen a single double commit from Stout this oh. series so far. But Wesley able to get the double tap. Makes it a one goal game with 30 seconds left. Messiah mistake there. Wesley sees the opportunity. Great double tap. Oh my gosh. Puts it. The bouncer. Interesting to see how the series ends up going. But 30 seconds left. We're going to see Milwaukee get something going. Soggy puts him back to the net. Soggy solo handedly giving their team a chance. To win this game, Chancho, a great pass. Soggy putting it right behind the last defender of Stout. All right, gets it. Three, two, one, and that is the series. Stout wins against the Milwaukee Panthers. Huge sweep coming from them. I did not expect that at all. That Stout team is the best team I have seen in WCRL ever. right now starting off with a bang we have wesley scoring just 20 seconds in right now 50 50 off chancho works out in wesley's favor and he will 50 through oh that just kind of affected them a little bit absolutely and that fake is going to wow. lead to another one quickly as milwaukee probably still warm from the match they just played come out hot to start it off see and this is what I love from the last match that I was able to watch is that 50 starting to go to teammates here. Josh pops over one, doesn't get over two. Chancho going for the redirect and he'll get it. What a shot there by Chancho. Wow. Announcing his presence with authority there as the Panthers will go up by three in game number one. That's a beautiful setup there from, from his teammate. Beat the Milwaukee or Milwaukee's doing here, just keeping that pressure continuously going. Like I said, and that's just a beautiful, beautiful shot there by Wesley. Yeah, I mean, there's not much else you can do there. Wesley just in the perfect position, rotating off the ball to make sure that if it does happen to just have able to get it out to Remix and Zoggy's just gonna take that one for himself, being able to put that away. Yeah, Remix tried to slow down the pace of the game there. The 50 doesn't work out in his favor though because Soggy is just there with the immediate counter attack. But nice shot also by Joshua being able to put it on there and make it as awkward as possible for him. And Chancho here is just now slotting him for himself from half the field. Yeah, Chancho there. It's one of those moments where you're like, you've been seeing the net be peppered so many times, you really weren't expecting the sauce to come from uh, the other half of the field there. Zach saw then it's a Soggy now. Oh, and Soggy is going to be able to find the top left corner there. Is that from the sidewall? It no was a sidewall shot. Slotted in the upper 90, just past Joshua there. Follow-up shots there. And it is in for Soggy. Beautiful. Seems like Madison just wasn't quite able to get there in time. Shot came in at just the right speed to get around Joshua there. And ultimately, that is the end of game number two. Touch, but gets the fake off of it. Chancho though going all the way to the backboard, looking for the double, it doesn't need it as it falls just below the bar. Milwaukee goes up 1-0 in game three. He saw that, he was like, I'm gonna get up. He said, thank you, I'm gonna put this right away. Able to get the touch though on very low boost. The follow up is there and off the bar, followed up immediately by Wesley because the Milwaukee Panthers, they want it folks. They wanna keep moving on and they're gonna keep the pressure high to do so. I almost thought he had the double on that. I thought he was close enough. Off the bar, thanks to Remix. Beautiful save. Fake there, underneath, and the shot will wow. be in, though, by Wesley. That was beautiful. I was too busy looking at the save that he had. Nice little demo there, being able to go low and just getting the nice fake. That was a dirty fake. Off the way, Soggy tries to follow, gets around one, gets around two. Remix able to Ooh. not get there in time, and Wesley does it again. Wow. Soggy here just being able to set his teammates up so well for these fabulous, fabulous plays and fabulous shots that are being put on net that Madison push it down the field with Turtles. Wesley already up for this ball, being able to put it on net. And it's Beautiful. starting to look all but over for Madison College here in game number three as they have to get three goals in 21 seconds. Soggy just trying to pass it mid, but it'll be cleared away. 
And Madison College will lose another goal in the final 10 seconds as they tried to throw everything but the kitchen sink at it. Just a beautiful clear there by Wesley, being able to get it downfield, being able to sink it through. that no one can quite be there to capitalize on. No one was there, but we have Chacho putting it back in the net. We are starting off 1-0, early lead here. We saw BD with a great 50 here, but Chacho, I was waiting for them, and they showed up and Chacho delivered. Now Wesley up in the air trying to find his teammate, oh. just doesn't quite connect. The shot on net, I did not expect this. I don't think anyone expected. Wesley snipes the corner, great passing play to West. The song, but fakes it. Gets the bumping play. We were talking about bumps earlier. This is crucial. Starting off with a bump, getting things on a demo immediately, and maybe that's what Milwaukee needs to start it off because we got a goal in the first six seconds. Wesley listening to exactly what we said. Need to get the pressure started going. Great demo plays. We've not seen enough demo plays coming from Milwaukee. Getting this game started. When they scored friends, when it comes to this, we've seen back and forth, and it seems like Eau Claire's been stopped out. What a shot coming out from Wesley. Holy smokes. That is a clip and a half. Yeah, you can't ask for a better shot from that than that off the wall there. Taking it from the sidewall to the opposite side of the net there. It's irrelevant for them. Yeah, I couldn't agree more. I personally, wow, we got it just out of nowhere. Cutting us off, we got Chancho sliding it in there on the goal line. Just slipping through the defense of Tizzy. Tizzy gets a mistouch, and Chancho there to capitalize immediately. It's as I mentioned. Yeah, you know, it's it's just once again there. What a passing play. Bang, bang, bang. Chancho puts two up right there. Wow. Great, great play coming out from Sagi. He saw that vision, saw the opportunity. If he shot on net, Dominic. Devil play coming out. Huge devil play. Sagi and Wesley. We have a series on our hands. Yeah, no one seems to be safe right now as Tyrant probably could have made a 50 there, but had to dodge the demo and ultimately the third man taken out by it anyway. Great 50 come from BD. The way that he read Wesley was incredible. But we have 30 seconds. Is that an open net? Soggy puts it back to that. Eau Claire's falling asleep in the back front. Oh, ultimately Eau Claire just tried to move all people up on offense there. They wanted to end it before OT, but that could have cost them the entire game there. I think they got a chance of getting at least one more game out of here. Wesley, oh, the shot Chancho puts in back in the net. I believe we just saw a double commit there on defense. Yeah, we see Tyrant and Tizzy both jump there instead of one of them repositioning in the Panthers cap. Talking to Wesley again. Possibility for Chancho just flicks it over. Easy like Sunday morning. Yeah. <laughs> We're sitting here. They've got a textbook 1v2 going here. Because the thing is, if you're the defender, you really got to watch. Series just, they had a fluke. Possibility, Wesley. This might be the nail in the coffin. I don't want to say it this early, but we need Eau Claire to tighten up their defense. And right now, there's the bumps coming out from... Milwaukee and just suffocating Milwaukee. Or his teammate to get there in time. I like the communication there, both BD and- Shot on net! Going. Chancho! Chancho just able to handle that. Moment it pops off that curve, he read it just a little bit quicker than Tizzy and no one's able to get there in time. Composed though, gets the 50-50 in the corner. The pass is there and the shot is in for Chancho. Is that a hat trick? I believe it is for Chancho in this game. Chancho! Looking deadly at the moment. Wesley, what a great pass. And I hate to say it, that might be the nail in the coffin. Let me introduce to you the following lineups. We have Milwaukee Panthers, seven and one. They were able to throw together 23 wins and only five losses on the season in their matchups. Let me bring you Soggy Tangles! We'll also bring you good old Wesley! And Chancho! Wesley, putting that one into the corner, pass off to Soggy, and it's a goal! 
And just like that, it is 1-1, one one, 3.45 on the clock, and this is action-packed. I know it's true. Wesley getting in the face of the defender. Doggy trying to put a shot on passes it off to Chonko. What a pass and what a finish from Choncho. Beautiful shot there by Soggy to set up Choncho and knock it in. And it looks like they might have to settle in on defense again. Good opportunity right there for MKE and Choncho finds the back of the goal. Milwaukee Panthers offense is looking so deadly right now. Choncho with a beautiful shot, perfectly top left. Is continuing to figure out this MKE Panthers team. And will the Panthers get it? Unfortunately, just let me correct myself. They do in fact score. Soggy Dangles throwing it down. Wesley with the self double. It's barely off on backboard and Soggy able to put that one away. Offensive play. Stout is on defense a lot of the time. And right as I say that, I was about to say their defense holds. But right as I say that, their defense breaks key. Just not getting the best touch. Chancho able to put it in the back of the net. Chancho knocks it across. Looks for something big up top. Gets a flip reset, but does not work. Wesley able to put that one in the back of the net from the ceiling shot. Pass to a goal. Wesley, what a great shot. What great placement. The corner trying to gain possession. Wesley, a quick shot and a quick goal for Wesley. Three shots, two goals. Wesley is sniping right now. And I'm not just saying it because that's a celebrity's name. I said, I'll say it a hundred more times. Wesley with the goal and not just that, but the hat trick. Wesley is playing out of his mind in this game. A hat trick for him. We could see overtimes in these games unless Milwaukee Panthers just sweep the rest of the games as it looks like, it lo excuse me, as it looks like they're doing right now out of the net and save it, but they're not able to save Choncho's shot in the end. A possibility for a Brazil in this game. Everyone taking the opportunity to throw it in that goal for the MKE Panthers. That is a lot to say for this. By Messiah Key getting insta challenged. A pass middle. Wesley with the with the shot. Not surprised to see that name on the board once again. Wesley's been throwing it in time and time again and finding a way to make things happen here. Now, as Key. Having to fall back and Choncho, a quick shot. Milwaukee Panthers up 2-0 in this game now. What surprises me is the name that I'm starting to see a lot more making plays. Maybe not popping up on the board in turn. Down, that was on target. Stout is so, has to be upset right now. Two opportunities late in game, both missed. Can Stout find it in this one or will MKE Panthers reset the bracket? And the Panthers have done it. They have officially reset the bracket. We have another best of seven coming your way. 14 seconds in, Milwaukee Panthers to reset the bracket. He's still able to get to that ball. If you're in chat, make sure you shout out your team. MKE on the board. 104-13 on the clock and a quick score. Both destroyer just looked a little bit awkward though, like he didn't know what was happening. Lock that one. Goes middle for a teammate, and Soggy able to put it in. Milwaukee Panthers leading in the game. Little bit of a kick out there by Chancho, setting up Soggy and throwing it in, putting up the Panthers to this series. They want to win the WCRL land, and they are not trying to go home early. What was that? Chancho with a beautiful set up top and knocking it down with that double tap. That was absolutely beautiful from Chancho, putting it 
game one and uw stout is down by one as time looks to expire mke panthers getting another luxury goal to lock it down milwaukee panthers are looking comfortable in this game uw stouts only two goals i believe we just saw a quadruple commit there i'm sorry that was just kind of funny not funny anymore soggy able to put it in what a beautiful shot there by soggy dangles finding that side goal and getting it kicked across by a defender giving great job for him to get up to that quickly oh my goodness messiah what was that a terrible 50 if you're milwaukee panthers that's a miracle if you're uw stout that is unfortunate that they desperately needed back wall leaving it for a teammate Volt destroyer getting a pass or getting a save but how much can you do when it's just off of the ceiling and wesley is there wesley getting on up finding the mark and getting it into the back of goal three found they got to be thinking of every possibility and every outcome because right now mke panthers are looking to try to take it home putting them up two to nothing 218 on the clock that was just great awareness from chancho sensing the open net and eight wesley getting on the ball and going for the double tap and it is in wesley setting himself up beautifully in this mke panthers have struck with three minutes and 19 seconds on the clock. So their squad, they might be a little bit more comfortable, but that might be for the worst as we see an opportunity. Soggy putting it in the back of the net. What a shot from them, tying up the game two to two. Beautiful play there, a beautiful death left in this game. It's a tie one. And Volt Destroyer wants to make it not tied. Messiah, not the best touch. And Soggy gets credit for the goal, but it was really just a misplay from Stout. That must be the nerves getting to them. The pressure is definitely settling in on this. We might see a game seven. Nail biter indeed. The clock is winding down and it is tied once again. It is like an old fashioned game of ping pong back and forth, back and forth, but eventually someone has to give. Bold Destroyer missing that mark. This could pay off in bad fashion. UW Wesley with the score. Milwaukee Panthers just find them in a 2v1 situation. Take advantage of it. And they're up by one. Credit. A bump on the back line. Key not able to put it in. Milwaukee Panthers are your WCRL champions. Yes, they are indeed. The Panthers fought and they fought hard. They clawed back and they are walking home victorious.